We try to have a positive attitude as much as we can, but we have our days, you know, we're human and, and it's tough. Both of Melanie Kelly's sons have <laughs> Duchenne muscular dystrophy, a degenerative disease that mainly targets boys. 19-year-old Jacob and 15-year-old Liam, who also has autism and epilepsy, have been robbed of the ability to walk, sit up, and bathe themselves. It's been extremely challenging. Um, you know, they rely on us for all of their personal care at this point. And, you know, you're watching your, your children slowly, progressively decline in their abilities. But several years ago, Kelly learned of a Teplerson, the first drug of its kind, currently in clinical trials that treats a subset of those with Duchenne. It is designed to produce a protein that's missing in patients, increasing muscle function, slowing the progression of the disease. I've seen videos of a child at 15, not just walking, but running a little bit. I mean, this is unprecedented. Duchenne muscular dystrophy affects one in every 3,500 boys. Kelly is considered a carrier. Both of her sons were diagnosed when they were very young. Most kids with Duchenne's don't, um, this part's tough for me. It's okay. Um, don't live past their 20s. This Torrington mom has joined a group of parents pushing the FDA for accelerated approval of the drug. In this briefing document, prepared for an important advisory committee meeting scheduled for late January, the FDA questions the effectiveness of a Teplerson. Due to severe weather in Washington, D.C., the meeting was canceled, leaving families in limbo. In a statement, a spokesperson writes, the FDA is prohibited by law from commenting on pending applications. We recognize the huge unmet medical need in Duchenne muscular dystrophy and the great urgency to make new treatments available. Of course, I'm nervous. This right now is my only hope. But Kelly is fueled by a committed community rallying the public by circulating a petition. Sign it, share it, um, get vocal. You know, awareness is the only way that we, we're going to make a difference. <laughs> a mother's passionate fight to help her boys, all boys, with a devastating disorder. Kelly hopes to learn the future of a Teplerson by springtime. These are children. And if we can do something to make their lives better, to improve the quality of their lives, then that's what we should do. That's Mommy Minute, Sarah Cody, Fox 61 News.